Dunavon House um, is part of Sunbeam House Services. Um, it's based here in Rathdrum. Um, it's one of three units in the Rathdrum area. Um, Sunbeam House provide um, services to adults with intellectual disabilities um, and it's been open for quite a few years in the Rathdrum area. The other two units will be relatively newer as compared to it. It's a 24-hour nurse-led unit, which means that there's a nurse on at all times there, and that's related predominantly to the medical needs of the clients that would live there. There are 11 full-time residential clients who live there. Um, they vary in age from 23 up to 50. Um, it's been quite exciting this year. This is the first time that we've had um, transition year students come down to the unit and it's really welcomed and appreciated. It's not only um, enhanced the lives of the clients in the unit, it's also made us as a staff team look at what we do and maybe ways that we could do things differently. Um, it's great to have extra people on board to do activities with the clients that maybe we don't get time to do sometimes. Um, simple things like hand massages, which the clients really, really enjoy. Um, other things like walks out into the community, especially when you've got really good weather. It's been a privilege having the students come down. Um, as I said, it's a great link that we have forged now between um, Avondale Community College and um, Dunavon. Um, so it opens up new opportunities for the future. Hopefully more students will be interested and want to come on board and um, to come down to visit and be involved. Um, also as well, it, it, it'll help raise the awareness and profile of people with intellectual disabilities because sometimes people aren't really quite sure what intellectual disabilities mean or other times people have misconceptions of what it means so it's nice to come down and see and get involved um, and I'm sure if you spoke to the students that have been down hopefully for them it's been a worthwhile experience and that they've enjoyed it and that they would come back and recommend it to their fellow um, students to come here if they were looking for placements. Community life um, for the residents of Dunavon would be the same as it is for um, yourself or myself. Um, the only thing would be, it's actually, there's a lot of challenges for our clients accessing their community because one um, hill down into the town, which is not really an issue as compared to coming back up out of the town when there's a hill to go upwards. And if you've got people who use wheelchairs, unless they've power packs attached, it's extremely difficult on the staff to support the clients to come back to the unit because you actually have to physically push them back up the hill. As you're probably all aware, the shops, most of them are not um, wheelchair accessible, which is a real shame in this day and age. Also, the footpaths, there's been a great amount of work done with the footpaths in that they've been widened and actually put in in some areas. However, it still doesn't stop people parking up on the footpath. It hasn't addressed some of the issues down in the town where there is... Um, steps coming out of the shops out onto the footpaths which mean that if you're going along with a wheelchair or even a, a mother with a buggy you have to go down onto the road to come back up onto the footpath. Our clients would access community um, places like we would so they go to the hairdressers to the credit union to the bank down to the shop um, and again you know they get great um, rewards out of going downtown because it is their local community and we all want to be part of something and so it's the same for them. I would, as you can see from the house and when you pass by, it's quite a large residential unit. So I suppose it, um, it would be lovely to see the unit downsized. There's a move at the moment to move away from congregated settings. So you don't want people living in houses where there's eight, nine, ten people with disabilities. The, the sort of move now is for a maximum of four to five people in each house. So that would be a, a, an aspiration, that would be a dream.